This question comes from a subscriber on the channel. I started my car up and I see water coming from my exhaust. Is that normal? Well, it can be normal, and typically it is normal. If you have been running your engine for some time and you have hot exhaust gases still in your exhaust system, as everything starts to cool down, that what would be almost like vapor ends up turning into what would be liquid just sitting in the bottom of the exhaust. But that's why we have vents to get the exhaust out of the car, right? To to route things and, and create a specific type of flow the manufacturer likes to see. Also at the same time, in those bends, sometimes you'll see little holes. You'll also see like a hole before the muffler, before a specific component in a certain area. Sometimes you'll have dual mufflers. It'll be like a resonator muffler and then a muffler behind it and you'll see a little hole in the bottom of it or a hole right before the muffler going out. When you start the car back up, it starts to push that exhaust gas back out and it'll push that water through the exhaust system and you'll see like little drips. Sometimes if a vehicle has been running for a long time and it's cold outside or it's just not very hot in general, uh, a lot of people will think, well, you shouldn't get any water out of your exhaust. That's not necessarily true. Uh, through the catalyst process that goes on inside the catalytic converter, through its chemical reactions with the different types of precious metals that are in there, it could actually create moisture it's part of its job when it starts to break down harmful gases and stuff like that or burn off or the catalyst change between things that happen uh, across that erodium, iridium, uh, platinum, stuff like that that may be in your catalytic converter. So seeing water come out of your exhaust is completely normal. Now I've had a car that I bring in from outside and I let it sit and run in my stall for a little bit. Before the engine gets the operating temperature, you look down and you see it's got little hissing almost like a mist coming from the exhaust system and then you get a little puddle underneath it. And then after you run it for a while, it stops. You know, it's it's normal, that's completely normal. If a vehicle's been sitting for a while, uh, what could cause a little bit of an issue is if the fuel itself starts to become compromised. If you're not driving your vehicle often and it sits and you got old fuel in there and you're not topping it off and putting fresh fuel in there, it'll actually start to break down a little bit and you can get a little bit more fuel um something that your 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 engine is you, you get a lot more water byproduct the fuel is not up to par anymore because it's been sitting it'll absorb moisture and things like that if you don't keep your tank full stuff like that moisture and stuff can get in the tank and this is stuff that gets pulled through the fuel system sprayed back into the engine and a lot of times uh, you pump a lot of that water vapor and stuff back out into your exhaust system so these can be normal things. Now, I would be worried if it was like colored and if it was like a white smoke and it had a sweet smell, um, that would be completely different. That would mean you would have some kind of internal leak that needs to be taken care of or looked at. But if it's just simply clear fluid and it's not causing a problem, it's not uh, causing the vehicle to misfire or anything like that, that is simply a normal condition. That is why you have little holes throughout your exhaust system in just random areas. It could be you know above like the pinch weld area or the weld seam of a muffler or a specific type of resonator or something like that that is to allow moisture out of the exhaust system that is completely normal and then again the catalyst process on what your catalytic converter goes through through its conversion it also creates a little bit of moisture and stuff like that now when the engine's hot everything's hot uh, it'll come out as a non um, visual effect you're not going to be able to see that there's actually moisture in the air and you have to think about it too when you have co2 and h2o and the converter is doing its job you're going to have a little bit of byproduct there of some moisture you know that's that's part of the conversion process that's how it cleans up a lot of the pollutants that go out into the atmosphere so to answer your question uh seeing a little puddle of water underneath like a car that's been sitting and idling for a long time is absolutely normal there's nothing uh, abnormal about that if it doesn't smell and the vehicle is running fine and it's not like an excessive excessive amount there's nothing wrong with that that's normal it's completely normal so to answer your question um from what you told me no smell it's not a huge puddle that's normal you're okay you're fine